Hi, I'm Mimi Null and welcome back to my kitchen. This will be my last video made for the Real Women of Philadelphia and quite honestly I'm a little sad about it. It's been a fabulous opportunity and a great experience. However, I did save my best dessert recipe for last. And what I'm going to share with you today is how to make Ma Mom's peanut rolls. And Ma Mom is my brother's mother-in-law who is a fabulous baker. She makes candies, cookies, pies. She just has the knack. Whatever she makes is just delicious. And so these peanut rolls have been around in our family for many, many years. And they, have, they are quite honestly legendary. People ask for them, look for them, talk about them. They are just unbelievable. In fact, fabulous isn't even a big enough word to use in describing them. They are outrageously delicious. And the other thing is my father loved peanut rolls. They were his favorite, favorite candy. So whenever I make them, it makes me feel a little closer to my dad. So they're just a special recipe all in all. So let me show you how to make Mom Mom's peanut rolls. First, you start out with eight ounces of Philadelphia cream cheese and two sticks of butter and a teaspoon of vanilla. And you put that in your mixer. And what I've already done is I've, I've gone ahead and mixed that together. And then you gradually add two boxes of confectioner's sugar. And that will give you the creamy white center we'll use for this candy. And what you do after you mix that together, I like to put it in the refrigerator just to firm it up because it is the center of a candy and we are dipping it into chocolate. You can even put it into the freezer if you'd like it to chill faster and you need them sooner. So from that I then I took them out of the freezer and I use a melon baller, the small end of the melon baller, and I just grab a little bit of the center and I roll it into a ball. And in the meantime, I've melted some bittersweet chocolate in a double boiler, which if you don't have one, I recommend getting one, especially if you like to dip strawberries or candy. The double, double boiler is a great investment. So what I do is I also use a cook, uh, candy time, um, a dipping time, and I go ahead and I dip it into the chocolate, let a little bit of the chocolate drip off, and then I have sitting waiting next to me is a bowl of chopped peanuts. So you just use um, salted peanuts and I grind mine up in the blender and then you roll the chocolate covered candy into the peanuts, hence peanut rolls. And that's it. They are so delicious you will just love them. I, I just can't even explain. They have been in our family thanks to my mom and they just are, are part of our family, and they are outrageously delicious. In fact, I'm going to try one right now. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, my goodness. See, they have the, the smooth center, dipped in chocolate, mm. and the rolled in peanuts. I hope you have a chance to make this recipe, and I know you're going to enjoy it. So, take care. Enjoy. And I hope to see you soon. Bye.